Climate change is the greatest health threat facing humanity. And the science is clear. We need urgent action and we need it now. There's now clear evidence that the climate crisis is a health crisis, and particularly so for those in the workforce who are facing increasing temperatures whilst just trying to do their jobs. People are suffering from polluted air, unsafe water, extreme temperatures, and many lack the resources to cope. From heat wave to air pollution, climate change is already harming human health and putting pressure on the health infrastructure across the globe. Physiology is the science of life. It tells us how the body responds in extreme situations, how close we are to the limits of our survival, and what we need to do in order to remain functional and safe. And it's time now to move from evidence to actions to impact. And of course, while the priority is to keep the fossil fuels in the ground, in parallel, we could do a much better job of protecting the health of our workforce. We need to ensure that we have the interventions, the solutions, that will protect particularly the most vulnerable populations. In doing so, that would enable our economy to grow in a more resilient and more equitable way. The Global Climate and Health Summit, here in London, is a rallying call. This summit will bring together the experts and the communities most effective to co-develop and work together on solutions. Forging partnerships and the momentum needed to take action to save lives, to raise collective voice and to drive action. An opportunity to share experiences and knowledge that can help us to shape our solutions that are practical, that are also inclusive and grounded in local realities. With interactive workshops, cross-sector collaboration and cutting-edge themes, the summit is a unique opportunity to turn evidence into action and shape real-world solutions for a healthier, more sustainable future. We at Welcome look forward to participating in the summit and building on the outcomes that are proposed.